I teach you the basic kick. And most people, when they kick, they just do this. They swing it around. They swing their hips. That's not what you want to do. You want to have, you want to have control of your kick. It's not about power. It's not about speed. Most people do this, like that. But what you want, you position yourself straight. Keep your one foot forward, one foot back. Particularly your powerful leg should be back. So what you have to do is make sure that your hips are aligned, make sure that they're straight, keep your hands up. And what you have to do is go for the kick. When we go for the kick, make sure everything's straight. And all kicks rely on your hips turning. So you, what you want to do is you want to kick like that. You just want to, you want your leg so as still as possible, but make sure your hips turn in with like this, like that. That's the key. You want to make sure that your leg is turning with it. So it's got to be like this, like that. Not like this. There's no power, you're going to hurt your hips. What you want to do is you've got to twist your hips with it. And you've got, to, you've got to work on your knee. So your knee is what gives it the distance. Good knee work is important because you can get it from here. You can get it from here. Or even a close one. That's it. That's it. Simple. That's just good knee work. Hips. You have to twist your hips. What you want to do and don't worry about power, don't worry about speed, just worry about technique. Worry about, focus on hitting it perfectly and consistently, rather than how powerful your kick is, how fast it is. Technique's the most important thing. So what you want to do, twist your hips, so go in, kick, make sure your knee is up and your hips are out here. So what you want to do, Let's try it again, ready? You do this, like that. Even if you want, twist your leg like that. Twist, make sure you have good, a stable, stable footing. What, your front leg should always be supporting your back leg. It's all about balance. So what you want is this. You can put your, you can even twist your legs to the side. It doesn't matter. What you want is this. Like that. That's it. Just technique. Just technique. Pure technique. That's it. That's it. Don't need no more, no less. You don't need any, anything else. Ready? Just technique. No power, no speed, no nothing. Just technique. That's it. Other leg. That's it. And make sure you always point your toes. Point your toes out like a ballerina. So if you add your hip, your hips twisting like that, you add your knee, knee work, toes pointed, and you just work on your technique and positioning. Make sure they're facing forward, one, one foot forward, one foot back. And as you go to the twist, turn, turn your hips in. Ready? Now you obviously you don't want to start off high, start off hips. Start off whether you're belt high. That's the key. Ready? That's it. As you want to do flex, you don't want to be stretching. Make sure you do exercises that are going to improve your flexibility so that you can have more range of motion. You can hit them here, you can hit them here. And also, it widens your hips as well. 
Ready? I'll show you again. Ready? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see.